Let us try some examples to determine the maximum and minimum steel area of reinforced concrete element. This is an reinforced concrete beam. The dimension is 150 times 450. The concrete grade is 30. The top reinforcement bar is 2T12 and the bottom reinforcement bar is 2T16. The shear length is R6150 and the concrete cover is 25. You may pause the video for you to work out the solution. This is the solutions for you to determine the maximum and minimum steel area. First of all, you need to find your AS mean. To determine the AS mean, there are two equations that you need to refer. First one is 0 0.26 FCTN divided by FYK BD and the second one is 0 0.0015 BD. This number is due to the concrete grade. Different grade will have different numbers. So you need to substitute the equations or you may refer to table 3.1 for grade 30 then you will get FCTN equals to 2.9 Next, you need to calculate the D, the depth The D is calculated by 450 minus the cover minus the shelling and minus half of the reinforcement bar so in total it will be 411 mm so you substitute the value into the equations you get your as mean equals to 93 mm square then you use the other equation you generate as mean equals to 92 mm square next you deal with the ax maximum AS maximum is determined by 4% of the cross-sectional areas which is 0 0.04 times the width of the beam 150 times the height of the beam 450 The AS maximum will be 2700 mm square Next, you need to find your AS provided For 2T16 you use simple circular equations pi r square times 2 you will get 402 mn square so your as provided is found to be in between the as maximum and as minimum therefore the maximum and minimum steel area is considered acceptable next we deal with the slab this is a slab. The thickness is 150, the concrete grade is 25, and the main reinforcement bar is T10200, the secondary reinforcement bar is T10300. Your specified use strength of the reinforcement bar is 460, and the cover is 25. You may pause the video for you to work out the solution. This is the solutions for reinforced concrete slab to determine the maximum and minimum steel area. First of all, you need to deal with the main reinforcement bar. You know that the concrete grade is 25. You can use the equations to generate FCTN or you can refer to the table 3.1 in Eurocode for you to get FCTN equals to 2.6 for grade 25 concrete. Next, you need to calculate the depth. The depth is calculated by 150 the height of the slab minus the cover 25 and minus half of the main reinforcement bar so the depth is equal to 120 again two equations that you need to use to generate an s mean which is this and this so once you have a s s f c t m and once you have the d you can substitute the equation in in this case we are dealing with the slab so normally we will use the width of the slab equivalent to one meter width as a unit width of the slab so substitute the value you will get 
as mean equals to 176.2 for the other equations 0.0013 BT is used this 0.0013 is due to the concrete grade 25 substitute the value and again the B is 1 meter width substitute the value you get 156 mm square next you need to determine the AS provided in order for you to determine the AS provided you are going to check the main reinforcement bar T10 200 and you can refer to a table for the reinforcement bar being arranged in spacing so T10 200 is referring to bar size 10 and the spacing is 200 you will get 393 mn square so your AS provider is 393 as for your AS max your AS max is equals to 0 0.04 cross sectional area and then you use 1 meter width and the height then you get 6000 mn square so your AS provided now is in between of the AS max and AX min therefore the maximum and minimum steel bar area are acceptable as for the slab you have one more additional step you need to check the secondary reinforcement bar it is stated that your secondary reinforcement bar should have an AS mean of at least 20% of your main reinforcement bar therefore by multiplying 0.2 20% of the main reinforcement bar area you will get 79 and then you check your AS provided again we go back to the table for the reinforcement bar for bar size 10 mm and for spacing 300 the area of reinforcement bar it will be 262 and this number is greater than the AS mean therefore the minimum steel areas is considered acceptable